Do you have those annoying red bumps behind your arms, your legs, or your butt? I know they're harmless, but it makes all of us way too subconscious to wear any tank tops or anything else that shows off those areas. I know some cleansers can do the trick, but what is the most efficient routine? They aren't pimples, so you can't just pop them away. They aren't scabs or skin tags, so how do we get rid of them? Let's discuss exactly how to do that in this video. Hello, welcome to the channel. I am Professor Glow Up, where we talk about glowing up in every category based on actual scientific evidence, as well as give real practical tips and advice that you can apply immediately. In this video, we're going to talk about keratosis pilaris or chicken skin. First, what is it? Keratosis pilaris is the buildup of a skin called keratin. Excess keratin can block hair follicles or pores in the skin, forming small, hard bumps. The reason for the buildup is unknown, but nonetheless, it's very annoying. Who typically experiences it? Most young adults in their teen years experience it the most, but plenty have experienced it well into their 30s. It's not infectious, nor does it affect your health in the long term. Also, those with a higher BMI and or those who live in a colder, more dry climate tend to experience it more often. How do you know if you have it? If you run your hands behind your arms, legs, or butt, you'll feel that bumpy, red, itchy patches, and we're gonna discuss how to get rid of that right now. But first, we want to minimize the flare-up, so avoid shaving or waxing. Don't use bar soap or foaming cleanser as they tend to dry out more and keep your showers short. If you have any ways you reduce redness, please let others know down in the comments below. Use a mild cleanser about five minutes before jumping in, then wash it off. Look for a cleanser with these ingredients. Some sort of alpha hydroxy acid, such as glycolic acid, salicylic acid, lactic acid, a retinoid, or urea. If you don't know the right cleanser for your skin type, make sure to check out that video down below. After hopping out of the shower and your skin is damp, use a moisturizer with an AHA. If the redness is really bothering you, there are laser hair removals that will unclog those hair follicles that will help reduce the redness. Make sure you stick to this routine when showering and cleansing. You'll see an improvement in no time. Make sure to like and subscribe. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.